the Gordon Prize is, is a recognition of something that's really innovative, incredibly long lasting in terms of engineering education, something that really made a difference. When I got to Harvey Mudd, the curriculum was essentially a blank uh, slate. Teaching in the clinic was a different form of teaching. You were on the student's side, you weren't opposed, you were working together to solve a problem. In engineering education now, experiential learning is a big thing. Big thing. Project-based experiential learning. In the 1960s, that was unheard of. Period. All right. So that's what got started here. One of the big parts of this project was uh, was developing and delivering a prototype, which we have here today. Um, it's based off of technology that does indeed interpret when oil is being recovered through a vacuum system. Oh, everything excites me about clinic. <laughs> I mean, I think clinic is the reason I came to Harvey Mudd College. I strongly believe that if you want to know how to be an engineer, you have to, tr you have to try it out. It's a real world experience. And I think, honestly, it's one of the things that sort of far and away, when our students graduate, they're very well prepared for this kind of thing. They can walk into the unknown prepared. And I think clinic really, really is the reason for that. We've really built our entire curriculum to support the idea that we can go and have a huge array of, of clinic projects that really represent what the future of engineering is going to be and, and then have our students participate in those successfully. If your body's saturated with xenon within a certain time of your injury, you can actually limit the brain damage to the body. Xenon is so expensive. That's why we've created a closed circuit that recycles the xenon and that you can capture the xenon, but then there's problems associated with that, such as you have to remove the CO2 that the patient uh, breathes out, and you have to give the patient more oxygen to breathe in. And so when you talk about impact, one of the things that you can talk about is you can talk about producing a student who can go to work immediately, and that's a, that's a good impact. But that's a young and short-term sort of impact. The real impact is the transformational impact that occur years down the road when that student that you graduated actually is changing policy, dictating new technologies, and in position to fund or redirect resources in a way that actually creates a better, better society.